So this question says points A and B lie on a circle with radius 1. So I'm just going to just draw my circle. I have a point A, have a point B, and a center, and call that a radius of 1. Okay. And arc AB has length pi over 3. All right, so this arc right here, so this portion of the circle is pi over 3. What fraction of the circumference of the circle is the length of arc AB? Okay, so that seems pretty straightforward, right? So initially we use plug-in picture, right? Because I'm drawing this based upon what's been provided. But now I'm going to just translate what I'm reading here, which and essentially saying, hey, if you like have pi over 3, well, what fraction of that is it, you know, what fraction of the circumference is that pi over 3, right? So I want to actually just divide those things or create the fraction. Mm -hmm. So I can see, well, what is, what's my x value here? What is it that I get out of um, finding the fraction of the entire circumference represented by this arc? length of pi over 3. So this is a complex fraction, right? We have two fraction bars. So anytime I see that, I like to just separate them. So I'll say pi over 3, and then I'll use this division symbol, right? Divided by, and then my 2 pi r. Again, we know that r is 1, so let's just get rid of that, right? So really, that's just going to be 2 pi. So now, uh, whenever you're dividing fractions, and of course, I can call that 2 pi over 1, we can say, well, the first fraction stays the same. The division turns into multiplication, and the 2 pi over 1 turns into 1 over 2 pi. My pi's will cancel out, and what I'm left with is 1 over 6. So therefore, that is my answer. 1 6 is the fraction of the circumference of the circle that's represented by the arc length AB.